Hello everybody and welcome to a new video. I am Dinox86 and yes, this is my real voice. Before we started, I want to learn you that I'm uh, also French, so uh, my English uh, might be uh, kind of weird sometimes or, or pretty bad. I'm really sorry for that, but I can't cha change this. So uh, let's get this started. So uh, this new this video will be a tutorial on After Effects. It will uh, learn you how to work uh, with uh, two plugins, uh, which are Fayin and Helium 3D. So what we're gonna learn today look looks like this. So we wanna track uh, the sniper uh, reloading here and uh, bring a uh, element 3D to set uh, like a text to fit uh, to the track. So uh, Fein is a cool uh, plugin uh, which um, uh, do tracks uh, the footage and. Uh, and uh, things so it's a uh, yeah basically this is a motion tracking uh, plugin it do really a pretty good work uh, as well for uh, Helimon 3D that uh, create a nicer uh, 3D uh, full uh, 3D uh, object and particle uh, etc many things if you are not familiar with this uh, don't worry uh, you just have to download this. Uh, this is costing, but you can have it for free on uh, some uh, some website. So uh, I'm gonna learn you everything on this uh, tutorial uh, how to create this. So uh, I'm really sorry for the shitty uh, footage I took. Uh, just a green screen uh, reloading, something pretty basic. I didn't have uh, anything. Uh, better so uh, it's okay it's gonna be okay for this video so let's get this started we're gonna create a new comp uh, we don't really care of the setting uh, and to start just create a new solid so black we don't care and uh, this is the solid which uh, on which will be the element uh, effect so uh, the element 3D. Uh, so now you can add element to this one. Okay, element is here. We're gonna set uh, the text uh, later. Uh, now let's add the the footage we have here. Okay, the only part that uh, we want to focus on is the uh, reloading. That's the only part we want to track it. So, let's get this. Uh, I do uh, uh, a tweak, a, a keyboard tweak. So this is uh, this one. Alt, uh, Alt plus. Uh, I'm not sure in English what is it, I think it's the um, bracket or something. Oh, I don't know, you, you'll see on internet. So cut this part to this part. This is cool. This is, this is that's okay. So now we want this to, we want Feyen to track uh, the, the sniper uh, move. So, um, now we can add Fey in here. Donc, uh, so um, you add Fey in to the footage to track and uh, go to. Um, uh, before, before I need you to know that uh, it's it have to be Fey in gold because it uh, it support the 3D uh, movement and. Uh, and the um, camera export so be sure it's called so add track 
Now we have this uh, little windows that open. Uh, so basically, the setting here are the tracking uh, area, so the the interval to track. Uh, so we start from zero, yes, to uh, four seconds. That's okay. Uh, so uh, we don't have to change anything here. Just um, take the mask select so you can um, you can mask the scope and uh, something here like this you can hold the shift to make the the selection uh, area smaller and uh, control to make it uh, bigger so we can select like this it's enough I guess so now uh, set the higher tip to uh, in move so this means that uh, the, the stepper is moving if it's um, an object uh, an object in um, in the scene that which um, doesn't move so take this but uh, for now we need uh, an object that move so you can start to track and you can see here the progress so yeah that was pretty fast I hope it didn't uh, okay this is pretty cool as you can see that uh, the tracking is very very well done I love this uh, plugin because it does. Uh, for me, that's the best uh, plugin for tracking. So uh, now you have this uh, fade in plus holder, which you can uh, just delete. This is uh, ugly. And uh, now we want. Um, uh, first, we're gonna create uh, the Element 3D uh, text. So. Um, just said something like uh, I don't know Linux Linux 86 uh, for you. your nickname or um, just subscribe. Make this uh, center this. This is uh, better. And so you can uh, hide the hit, hide it. The you can hide the. Um, the text and then go to E3D layer, go to custom layer, custom text and mask, and to path layer one, just choose the text layer. Subscribe. Okay, now it's done. You can go to scene setup, and the new windows appear. That's the power of E3D. And now uh, we want the layer text layer to be in 3d for this just just click on extrude and that's done this is cool now you can uh, change a thing like um, the bevel scale yeah this is uh, weird let's uh, raise it okay the path extend so it uh, do a uh, pretty weird but this is uh, yes it can be useful but I don't know and maybe okay uh, now you can uh, add a texture to this to make it uh, to make it uh, look really cool And uh, maybe uh, if you are familiar with uh, Element 3D, you can uh, maybe add uh, an environment, uh, an av environment like this. If you hold Shift and uh, drag uh, the mouse, it uh, moves the environment. This is uh, complicated to explain this how it works, but uh, yes, it does a pretty good uh, work. 
So when you have done your uh, setting, you can in Element 3D, you can click OK. <coughs> and now the here is the the text. So uh, now go to um, the footage with uh, that you you just track. So in track one you can uh, well what is this? Okay, track one you have um, you may have this. Click on active, and so you have now uh, this uh, weird thing. Uh, that's the grid of the, the tracking made by uh, Fame. Uh, we doesn't do not care of uh, this. Just go to export and create new object with new camera. And now the new a uh, new object uh, have been created. Oops, here. So this is small, but you can see it here. The uh, the the null just uh, have the same place. Uh, the 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 null object doesn't move, but the camera here the camera here moves. So as the launch track is in, in 3D, the null just track the sniper so now we want the text here to be look uh, just in front of you just uh, like here so um, for this I advise no this you have to go to group run then group utilities and create group new <coughs> so so click create <coughs> so now we created um, a null object that uh, just uh, control the so the group null control the text here so when I move the null it moved the text so we want the position here to be on this object. So just uh, copy the position here to the position of the new here. Oh, come on, shut up. Thank you. So control C, control V. Okay, now it's here. And um, you can also maybe change the scale, the scale of this, and uh, so the orientation. If I do, oh. okay, the, the the text is reversed here. It's fixed. It. Oh, what the fuck? Come on. Um, yeah, no, this is weird to control uh, the here orientation. We can do it. Uh, uh. Okay, here we go. can move this to you can offset it to uh, be wherever you want I like here so now you can see that the text track perfectly the sniper You can see 
Uh, if you are not familiar with E3D, maybe you can go to render setting and uh, maybe add some uh, ambient occlusion. Uh, enable AO. So maybe we can really see. Then we can increase the intensity. Okay. And maybe. I'll put, you can uh, add some, um, you can uh, um, go to super sampling, set to 2, and uh, he hands multi sample, sampling, so now it looks really cool, and maybe add some uh, motion blur to E3D layer, give some more um, I don't know this is cool so yes that's it I think okay it uh, it uh, it work uh, better if you have a, a nice PC not um, a, um, a really expensive computer okay but uh, mine is not uh, the best, uh, so I guess it's, uh, it's slow. It's kinda slow. So, um, I think that uh, this is all for this tutorial. I think I said everything uh, you need to know. Uh, maybe you can see some uh, tracking error, but uh, I think that the lens of the sniper in uh, does suppose the support the lens uh, the lens um, movement or something so yeah it has some uh, but uh, maybe you can uh, check uh, other advanced tutorial fail so maybe it will uh, you can uh, change your things to to make this look better so that's all for this tutorial I, I hope you uh, you enjoy it if you if you do uh, just uh, drop a like or subscribe just like it's right and uh, yeah I hope uh, the, my English was not uh, so bad uh, I'm uh, so sorry uh, if the if uh, I don't uh, make a video for this moment. Uh, I just made this tutorial to give some of my some news, uh, which I'm not dead. So uh, maybe video will uh, montage parody will uh, come back soon. I don't know, or uh, maybe other stuff like this. Okay. So that's all. I. I say you uh, goodbye and maybe to uh, next time for a new tutorial on this really really cool plugin S oh, not plugin but software which is after effect and uh, yeah we'll see you next time